Hello people of the interwebs, Wayne Hackman here and yesterday on a game drive at Moogie Estate we saw an, a limping elephant and our guide called KWS, Kenya Wildlife Service and today they are tracking it, gonna dart it and see what's wrong with it and we hopefully we'll be able to come along for the ride and witness an elephant being looked after and hopefully put back into the wildlife feeling a lot better. So we've uh, had the phone call that uh, KWS are on site and are tracking the elephant. So we're going to go out and find where they're at and see, at the very least, see them having had taken the elephant down with a tranquilizer. Maybe we'll actually see the tranquilizing. I don't know. This is all very exciting. We are on our journey now to go and find this poor injured elephant. We shall call him Bob. the elephant uh, so the vets prepping up the equipment needed you can see the vet down here The mission was simple, separate mum and baby from the rest of the herd and then sedate mum before sedating the baby Ellie so that they can administer the treatment that that baby needed to recover from its injury. A simple plan in principle, but it was fascinating watching KWS, the vet and the park rangers manoeuvring their vehicles to intercept the paths of the baby elephant, its mum and the rest of the herd, preventing them from getting back together and becoming a full herd once again and the matriarch of the whole herd was also becoming a little bit troublesome and we'll see later as she tries to charge the working vet. The time came for the first dart to be administered. As the sedative took hold and mum fell to the ground, she let out this rather harrowing cry. I took it as her signalling to the rest of the herd, look, my time is done, please look after my baby. And you can see the matriarch now rushing in to help the baby, who by this point had been sedated and the vet was working on it. The only way that the rangers could keep the herd away from the baby by, was by making a huge amount of noise but she didn't give up and she looked quite threatening from time to time that scare him banging yeah Understandably, for safety reasons, the onlookers were kept away from the vet working on the baby because there was a real risk that we would have been caught in a charging herd. After about 15 minutes of this activity taking place, the vet did return to the mother. 
where they cooled her down using water and then administered the antidote. And I was incredibly surprised at how quickly mum got herself on her feet and went and found the rest of the herd. She's getting up, she's getting up. Yeah. Where's the baby then? This indeed was a unique experience, but we all drove away thinking, would this baby elephant survive? A creature that disabled in the world would certainly open itself up to attack from the many predators in the park. Well, the next day we had the opportunity to kayak on the lake behind these elephants. And as you can see, we stumbled across a herd, which we suspect is the same herd and all the baby elephants looked happy and healthy. Well done to KWS for rescuing and treating this baby so well. Thanks so much for watching. Please rate, subscribe, do all of the things that social media people do, and I'll catch you in the next video.